both of y'all two home runs. How's it feel to get the first rub up against uh, Louisiana? Um, you know, all week we've been talking about it. You know, Dalton, fifth-year seniors. You know, this is, uh, could be our last weekend series in San Marcos. So we've been talking about going out with the bang and uh, you know just making the most out of it. And I feel like we did that and helped team win tonight. So it was a good feeling. Oh, for, <laughs> um, yeah, we were talking about it, and uh, I mean, he got two homers today, and uh, that has our household hitting uh, ten home runs each. Yeah, um, and so that's a pretty cool thing to do, mm -hmm. and uh, I, I was so happy for this guy. Who else is in the house with you? Uh, John Wilson. Oh, John Wilson. Yeah. Nice. Um, yeah. Well, Wes, you know, almost a perfect time for you. You have to strike up for <laughs> right. but but tell us what was working so well for you at the plate. Uh, you know, sometimes you see golf balls up there, sometimes you see beach balls. Tonight it just kind of went my way, and I was just happy to help the team win. You know, obviously, it was a close game at the end, and the pitching staff did amazing keeping us in there. So I was just happy that we got the Friday night victory. Yeah, you, you've really caught fire these last couple of games. What do you feel like has started to click for you? Um, you know, just a lot of hard work. You know, I got through a little uh, slump there in the middle of the season, but I'm happy that I'm getting back to what I know I can do and uh, get fired at the right time at the end of the season, hopefully take it into the postseason. <laughs> well, tell me a little bit about what it was like to move back up to that cleanup spot because it's, it's not where you've been here most of the season. Right, yeah, it's been a while since I was in there. Uh, I was a little surprised, honestly, with the line of cards at the beginning of the game, but uh, Dry told me to be the guy tonight and uh, be the guy in the four hole and just drive and runs, and I did a decent job at it, so hopefully I'll stick around there for a while. Um, anything else that y'all want to accomplish with this weekend series being the last one here? Definitely just the sweep. Uh, we want to go out with Bang uh, and... Uh, keep our uh, first position in the Sun Belt. Mm -hmm. So four home runs uh, on the night was the most that Louisiana has given up all year long. Um, what does it mean to be able to do that against a program like that? Well, they've had a really good pitching staff all year. And uh, I mean, with our approach, we are just uh, trying to barrel balls right center gap. And uh, if you're a little early, you hit it up the middle, left center. Um, and if you're right on it, you uh, barrel it to right field. And I mean, that's just, when we, when we get into our approach like that, uh, we're really good. Well, yeah, um, Coach, you know, you, you guys held on there at the end. Tell us kind of what you thought we're on tonight. Yeah, I mean, obviously, uh, Zeke Wood off to another good start. You know, get the four in the one inning, but I thought he was really, really good. Uh, just kind of getting um, above their barrels. They couldn't get on time with it. And so, uh, you know, their whole, their whole, whole offense about getting the leadoff guy on and putting pressure on you. And so he did a really good job of minimizing that. And then, of course, Dixon did his thing and Stafford did his thing. So kind of another Friday night story for us. And then, um, obviously, the two guys you just talked about, what great swings those guys. Um, opposite field home runs and, and, and big swings. And so that was, uh, that was good stuff. You know, we made phasing up in the lineup today. He's been really high of late and uh, just kind of went with the um, just kind of with the dice there and said you know what he's hot right now let's move him up and thank god we did so yeah t tell us kind of what you've seen different from him these last couple of games where he's, he's just been on a tear lately. yeah you know he struggled early um, and then he got started going one thing uh, to be honest with you the wind started blowing out here and when that starts blowing out it kind of builds him up a little confidence because he knows he can drive balls out of here um, and then he started taking better swings and then the crazy part is he's becoming a better hitter starting to use the middle of the field more um, he's not just a one-dimensional hitter of, of hitting the ball to left field and hit it out. He's hitting balls to center, hitting balls out to, to right. Uh, even this weekend at Monroe, he was taking big-time swings in, in all parts of the field. And so um, he's just on time right now and, and uh, using all parts of it, so it's been fun to watch. Yeah, and you, you called it a roll of the dice, but what, what went into that decision to move him higher up in the lineup? Yeah, you know, sometimes, you know, when we, when we face lefties and we take Ben out, um, it kind of moves our lineup up. And then you just kind of look sometimes it's the last five, sometimes the last ten, just – Kind of a gut feel sometimes. He's just been seeing it well. He had so many RBIs this weekend. I felt like it went row and big hits. Uh, we just wanted to throw him in there. And so, um, yeah, hopefully it will continue on. So a senior weekend for these guys, how, is, how important is it to close out this series, get the last two wins, and get a sweep? Yeah, I mean, it'd be big for these guys. They, they've done so much for our program and obviously having a great year. And so I, I don't want nothing more to, to come out and win the next two and, and to have a good clean sweep for them. So uh, big game tomorrow, you know, with Levi Wells going to the mound. And, and uh, it'll be another tough battle with a good arm going for their side. So uh, just trying to come out and play good baseball. But, yeah, we want to send those guys out uh, the right way. So four home runs against Louisiana is the most that they've had on them all year long. Um, what does it mean to be able to do something like that against a program like Louisiana uh, for this team? Yeah, I mean, I just thought, you know, we, we talked so much about our approach tonight facing their first guy. You had to try to hit him the other way. And then, um, you know, FaZe was the big part of the field. And then the other home runs were opposite field. And so that's kind of what you got to do against those guys because they love to, to live on the outer half. And so um, just some, some really good pieces of hitting and got good pitches to hit. And they're veteran guys and they're really good. So that was, that was fun to watch for those guys.